it's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer and isn't life quite ironic? Go to work today in a Polish t-shirt. I rush home for the 4pm game for Poland versus Senegal which is on now in about five minutes as you can see over there on the Alexa kind of clock thing. And I get home and there's a slip through the door saying you've got some, you've got some mail with a neighbour. Go and get the boxes. Four boxes, I believe, because I had a conversation with Beer52, James from Beer52, thank you very much my good friend. Um, he sent me some Polish craft beer. I wasn't expecting this much. So let's get started. So Polish, you, you all know by now, uh, I've been a massive fan of Polish craft beer for the last four years. I brewed a beer uh, with Pinter called Call Me Simon. Uh, I brewed a beer with a Dr. Brew called Annabelle IPA. And I've been banging the drum to try and get Polish craft beer over here to the UK. Beer 52 is a UK company and it's finally here. It's finally here. Some Polish craft beer launched in the UK. First of all, some crisps. And yes, here we go. Here we go! Polish craft beer available to order in the UK from beers, beer52.com. Check them out, www.beer52.com. If you haven't tried, if you're watching this from around the world, if you're watching this from the UK and you haven't tried Polish craft beer, please, please, please go and order some. It's absolutely fantastic. This is not a paid promotion. I have not been paid a dime by Beer52. This is just my general excitement. First beer. Double dry hopped, double IPA from Bruva, Brother Stu Mastaf. Brother Stu Mastif. I've been there. It's the 100 Bridges Brewery in Poland. Fantastic place. I've had lunch there many a time. I haven't even got to look at the label to know actually. I've got a better check. It is, yeah. Brother Stu Mostow. I make room here. we got loads of beer. Uh, now we have a uh, Tres Compli uh, Brother Lotney Misty Contemporary IPA. I'm so, so excited by this. I really am. There's the bottle cap. The reason why I'm so excited, I, I'm wearing the uh, the Wrocław Beer Festival t-shirt here. I wasn't able to go la uh, just a week and a half ago. I missed it for the first time in four years. Really sad. My father-in-law was 60. I had to attend his 60th birthday party. Um, it was sad times really because I, I always thought that I'd be going to this festival every single year. Um, and at the festival, of course, I'm used to seeing all of these beers. I'm used to seeing them all. I'm, I'm, actually, this could be a new brewery. Oh, this is brewed in Belgium. This is uh, Millions of Peaches. So this isn't, it's a milkshake IPA. This isn't a Polish craft beer. Uh, but now we got another Tres Compli, Brovolotny, special edition, Black, Black Seal, Black IPA, Citrus Zest. It's coming in at 7% ABV. It's going to be the longest unboxing video, I think, of my life. Uh, Pinter, Vermont IPA. Really excited to try that. This is the brewery I brewed with, by the way. Uh, call me Simon. Uh, I'm not sure if it's still available. Uh, but American IPA, 6.1% uh, ABV. Brother Pinter, probably the, uh, the architects, really, of the Polish craft beer scene. They were the first brewery uh, uh, contract kind of... Micro, let's call them a microbrewery in Poland that, that produced fantastic beer. Zajtarillo. Zajtarillo for me was the famous. Zajtarillo was the first Polish craft beer that I ever tried about four years ago. Five years ago and it was terrific. Uh, we have another wheat porter by uh, another beer from Brother Stu Mostif. This is so made up. It haven't quite made up for me not going to... Uh, because I have friends there now and I miss my friends there. I miss Mr. Kapira and, and, and lots of other people, of, of course. Uh, Martin from Pro Beer TV, we all meet every year. And it's a bit of a bit of a shame that it didn't happen this year. This nearly makes up for 
not going to that festival. Uh, Panny Pam, I've reviewed, oh by the way, I've reviewed Hop Lagera before and I've reviewed Panny Pan. So I will enjoy, I'm going to put these to one side and I'm going to enjoy these beers. Oh, there's a magazine. Oh, it's, it's a ferment magazine. So I think, let's have a quick look in here um, because I don't want to take up too much of your time, guys. There might be a feature here on uh, Polish craft beer. In fact, Edinburgh. There might be something on Polish craft beer in this in this magazine. Let me hold it high. Oh, here we go! Here we go! Here we go! Um, Yes, look. Right, this is a massive, uh, big, but they're right, this big, big madness. I know all of this stuff. Uh, Bros in arms. Okay. Um, is this all of it? There's loads. Oh, Pinter. This whole thing, this whole magazine, uh, Ferment magazine, this whole magazine has um, Polish craft beer. There's, there's Lotney there. Uh, Brother Stimo Stav, Brother Stimo Stav even. Uh, I met these lovely people. Um, then we have probably, there's a brewery, brew pub. Um, I'm looking for, oh, I've just seen Pinter in here. There we go. That's um, Jimit, Jimit Fallat there. Uh, and the other two, I, I know, I know these guys wonderfully well. So there's a big, so guys, if you want to order this beer, uh, this magazine online, if you, even if you're in Poland, order this magazine. Big feature on Polish craft beer. Absolutely fantastic, guys. Right, let's put that down. And let's give it to that box. Okay, so, again, I do apologise for my complete excitement in this video. Um, it's just I've been waiting so long. For this to happen. I tried myself. I tried with distributors, um, I tried with companies to get Polish craft beer into the UK and it, I, it never quite happened for me. Man, I think they've sent me four boxes of the same beer. Another bag of crisps. Yeah. Another hop lager. Uh, another double dry hopped Oh man, uh, lots to drink on the weekend. Um, millions of peaches. Yep, yeah, okay, okay, so this box is the same. Pinta Vermont IPA. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna drink one of these. Panny Pan's an amazing beer. Misty, I'm really looking forward to drinking Misty. Um, that, that seems pretty good. Okay, so that's, let's put that on the cooker, let's open up another one. Maybe they made a mistake, or maybe they're just being really generous. Uh, beer 52. I wondered in that magazine, I'm just thinking to myself now, I wondered if that mag, in that magazine, oh, they sent me another box of the same. So another bag of crisps. <laughs> uh, another hop lager. Okay, so this is going to be like a repeat, double dry hopped, um, millions of peaches, um, milkshake IPA. Okay, so they sent me four. There's a part of me that's like, oh man, I was going to have like four different boxes of Polish craft beer to review. And then there's another part of me that's like, I've got loads of spare beer to drink on the weekend and share with people of course share with people that's that's the important thing I, I'm yeah I'm thinking out loud I'm wondering if they've done a feature in Ferment magazine of Thomas Capita um, for me I want to talk about Thomas Capita for a, a little while because um, he's a very very important figure in the Polish okay yeah we got four four boxes of the same of the same beer um, Thomas, Thomas Computer was the one who opened the door for me to go to Poland and brew a beer with um, Brother Pinter 
Uh, Thomas Computer was the person who opened the door for me to go and brew a beer with Dr. Brew. Uh, for me, Thomas Computer is, um, if you don't know Thomas Computer's channel, he has the largest beer reviewing channel on YouTube. He has something like 30, 40 million views. I just had a celebration video celebrating 5 million views. This guy's got like 30, 40 million. He's the top dog in Polish craft brewing. Um, he's written books. Um, he has like over 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. Um, he is the man. And I think, and I hope, I suppose we've got a minute now, haven't we? So shall I have a quick look? Where did that magazine go? There. Shall I have a quick look? Poland, look. Yeah, it's got Poland on the front. Oh, it's five past four. I'm missing the game. Poland versus Senegal. I'm five minutes into the game. It's five past four. Do I grab a Polish craft beer, go and sit down and watch the Poland game? Or do I have a quick scan through here? Oh, Matthew Curtis. I know Matthew Curtis. Matthew Curtis, um, he's one of the editors here. Matthew Curtis uh, and I used to play on the Xbox 360. We used to play Trials Evolution together with Real Alien 140. And we all used to thrash each other. And um, it was a motorbike game that you could play online and, and beat each other's times. Uh, I'm just having a quick scan. Right, we got to Pinter, didn't we? There's, there's brother Pinter. I want to see if, if they featured... Uh, Tomasz Kupira. Oh my god, look at that. Where is that? Is that Pinter's new brewery? That's insane. Oh, come on. Um, oh, I knew these guys. Uh, these are... Brokreatia. Bro Brother Brokreatia. They brew the fantastic... Uh, Alchemist beers, uh, not the, they do different cartoony style labels, they're really good. Uh, this is a feature on Beer Geek Madness, uh, there's beers there from um, El Brava. El, have a look at that, the tap, you might remember the taps, um, what I did the video in El Brava. Um, where else, what else have we got? There's... Um, uh, Zoytek, remember? Can you remember Zoytek? There's where my thumb is. There's remember Zoytek, a bloody wonderful guy. Ah, oh, there's got to be something with Tom Capita. There has to be. The guy is world famous. Well, he's massively famous in Poland. And now we're into sustainable kegs and stuff. So. Little bit of a shame. Um, I probably would have featured him. Okay, he's not a brewery. Uh, Tom Akopiada is not a brewery. He's a blogger. But he is so instrumental to the Polish craft beer scene. He probably got a number of these breweries brewing beer and getting up and running and, and watching his channel and, and deciding to brew Polish craft beer and, and becoming breweries themselves. He's, he's a big, big part of Polish craft brew. Anyway, that, 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 that's by the by, that's happened. Um, I got two, four, six beers, uh, six, 12, 18. I got 24 Polish craft beers with six to review and let's do my maths, 18 to drink. Thank you to James at Beer52 for sorting this out for me. Um, again, if you're watching in the UK, I really hope you have the opportunity to order some beer. I'll put the link in the description box of the video, beer52.com. Um, again, it wasn't a paid promotion. I wasn't paid at all for this video. I'm just really excited that they got Polish craft beer. I feel like I'm in a bit of a scratched record now, so um, maybe I open a packet of, packet of chili and lime crisps, put the football on, and open some Polish craft beer. Uh, look out for the reviews shortly, they'll be coming up, um, but please check out this website for Polish craft beer. Put your comments in the comments box, please subscribe to our daily beer reviews, give us a big fat thumbs up. One more thing, one more thing, I'm doing the whole Apple thing now, aren't I? one more thing. Um, I'm doing a collaboration in Poland, I'll be releasing it next week, the details. Cheers.